Now, what are the risk factors for recurrent UTI? First of all, remember that recurrent UTIs occur in 30 to 50 percent of children, and majority of them will occur within the first three months of the first episode. Not age, but within first three months of the first episode. So, what are the risk factors? The risk factors I'm discussing again. It's a compilation, combination of the risk factors given in a table in Nelson as well as mentioned in the Indian textbooks. So, first of all, most common risk factor for recurrent UTI is vesicouretic reflux. This is your need super speciality recent MCQ. So, most common risk factor for recurrent UTI is VUR. Then females are risk factor for UTI and so recurrent UTIs will be more common in females. They are common in age below 6 months, obstructive uropathy or anatomical disorders like labial adhesions in males. Constipation contributes to recurrent UTI by producing bowel dysfunction. Urethral instrumentation or repeated catheterization increases the risk of recurrent UTI. Malnutrition and immunosuppression can cause UTIs and uncircumcised males are an important cause according to Nelson 21st edition. Circumcision reduces the chances of UTI in male infants. But circumcision decreases the chances of UTI in male children as compared to uncircumcised males.